Hey, welcome back to South 10 Beer Reviews. I'm Tyler. Thanks for stopping by. Tonight, we're going to do a beer battle type deal. Um, haven't done that in quite some time on my channel, so I thought, why not tonight? I mean, going on vacation tomorrow. I don't want to leave these sitting behind. Um, I just wanted to go ahead and do it. So, we're going to do, for the first time, uh, regular Juicy Bits from Weldworks which is a 6.7 percenter and um, it's brewed with Citra, Mosaic, and Eldorado. And uh, then we've got the Eldorado uh, dry, Double Dry Hop Juicy Bits. And it's also 6.7 percent um, Citra, Mosaic Hops, and Double Dry Hop with Eldorado. Uh, this one it was canned on May 4th and May 21st so um, you know they're over that three month mark we'll see if it affects anything I don't know that it's really going to um, it's definitely possible but um, yeah we're gonna go ahead get them in the can or in the uh, glass sorry and uh, I think I might just use this here um, this one's a little taller I think so it might work better um, I think I might just do this, and that way I can leave them on the respected sides. So, um, yeah, we're going to go ahead and crack open Juicy Bits. Pretty excited about having Juicy Bits. I know it's one of those that's, uh, you know, kind of a staple in the hazy game. And uh, there's got to be a reason, right? All right, so, um, yeah, there they are. Um, they look identical in color. Uh, they both got a pretty creamy looking white head on it. Uh, the one, the double dry hopped is a little bit more compact, a little bit tiny bubbles. We got a little bit rockier ones on the regular juicy bits. But as far as the color, I mean, they both come in completely hazy. Um, it's got like a, a golden orange type of look to it. Sorry, you can probably hear my dogs. Um, but yeah, this, I mean, they look great. I love the color of them. So I think we're going to go ahead, we're going to get a nose on this one first and uh, kind of see how it goes. Oh man, that smells really, really good. It's just bursting with like orange. Um, huge amounts of orange. It's got like an orange starburst type of vibe going on. It's got like a nice orange like uh, pith as well. Mosaic's definitely coming through. It's got a little bit of that mosaic dank quality. Getting some pineapple in there. It's got a little bit of like a the green or the the hot the wow the citra is coming across but it's got that like green type of citra type going on it's like that earthy citrusy like I think I, and green is the best way I can think to describe it like think of green hot pellet you know hot matter just kind of right uh, ground up in your hands it's kind of got that it smells really quite nice. Um, let's go ahead and get a nose on this one too. Mm, okay. So it's got a lot of the same qualities. I'm getting a little bit more of a tropical vibe from this one though. It's definitely got to me more pineapple. It's got even like a little bit of a, maybe like mango or something. Just very faint. To me, the biggest thing is this one smells a little bit more tropical. Um, and the dankness is not as prevalent in this one. It's just, it's more juicy smelling. So, yeah, they smell fantastic though. I'm really pumped to try these. Let's go ahead and try regular Juicy Bits. Mm. That's good stuff. Yeah, I'm really, 
really glad I finally got to try, to try this one. It's it's very good. Got a lot of pithy citrus. It's not super bitter, but it does have a like that pithiness kind of gives it a bitter type of quality. Um, but it's got a lot of orange. I mean, it's like a juicy orange, like, I guess I could have just said orange juice instead of juicy orange, but, uh, so yeah, it's like an orange juice, but like a little bit of a, I don't know, it's got like almost like a green, like earthy matter to it. Um, definitely getting that pineapple coming through with that, um, uh, from the mosaic. And it's definitely got a little bit of that mosaic bitterness, or not, uh, dankness, sorry. I'm all over the place in this one. Um, yeah, I think that the mosaic is coming through in that like sweaty, like dirty gym bag type thing. Um, you know, it's got a little bit of sweetness that hangs out in the back, but quite dry. I just burped and it literally tasted like I've been drinking orange juice. <laughs> um, so yeah, I mean, fantastic stuff coming from number one, uh, which is regular Juicy Bits. I wish I would have had a way to set all these up, sorry. Um, I don't know if there's a way to do that. No, this thing's not big enough. That's what she said. Okay, um, we're gonna get into the double dry hopped El Dorado version. Man, that's just popping a little bit more. Mm, wow, okay. That is crazy how much how much of a difference that Eldorado is imparting into this one. Um, you know, I've had different beers where, or different um, series of beers from different uh, brewers who will use a different hop in one, a different hop in the other. And I don't, I mean, you can definitely tell a difference. But this one, I mean, I'm pretty sure they're the same beer. This one's just double dry hopped with with Eldorado with more Eldorado, I guess. So, um, see, this one actually doesn't say double dry hopped, the juicy bits. So it might not even be double dry hopped. Um, so that's crazy, man. I didn't expect it to impart that different or that much of a different flavor. Hmm. Yeah, this one's popping with like sweet pineapple. They're like a sweet pineapple juiciness though. It's definitely got a little bit of like a, I don't know, mango-ish, uh, maybe not mango. What is it? I don't know, maybe it's like a, some type of melon um, type of deal, like a, more like cantaloupe or something like that. But it's very faint. This one's just got a ton of that citrus underneath, but it's almost like layered. You're getting the citrus and that, and then, and that mosaic like dankness but then on top of all that, it's just like coated with like this juicy like pineapple thing. This one's like a little less bitter too, I think. Let's try this one again. Mm. It's hard to pick which one is better. After on that sip, this one kind of had like a little bit more of like a lemon vibe to it as well. Almost like lemon starburst. Lemon and orange starburst for days in this one. But this one, definitely less bitter, but it's got pineapple for days, like more so than this one does. Like it's just bursting with some pineapple. Pineapple, tropical vibes, citrusy, orange, dank, these are both fantastic though. So, um, I think though they're both great. I think I'm going to say this one is better in my opinion. I just like that, you know, that pineapple aspect to these burps taste great. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, I think I'm going to go with the winner being Eldorado double dry hopped juicy bits. Um, so as far as ratings on these, um, I'm going to go with a 
4.6 on this one and a 4.4 .4 on this one. So really solid stuff from both of them. I wish I would have had them even a little bit fresher than this, but I'm not worried about it. These are still fantastic beers. I'm super pumped that I was able to try them. Um, let's go ahead and, uh, you know, there's only one thing left to do. We'll do a little bit of a, uh, this is a smaller device. Let's drink a little out of this one. I'll do the good old trusty cuvee. All right, let's mix it a little bit. There we have it. This is a cuvee. Oh, shit. We almost spilled that. All right, there. Is that good enough for a thumbnail? <laughs> uh, but no, there we go. Okay. There's our cuvee. Let's go ahead and try this one. This video is running a little longer, so I apologize, but uh, if you're still watching, thank you. I mean, it smells like juicy bits. Huh, okay. Dude, that might be the winner. So that one actually gives obviously the best of both worlds um you know with this one you're getting a bunch of pineapple like kind of like the double draw hop version was giving you but you're getting like the pithiness and the art of the pit like the bitter like pithy orange from the other but it's also got like some melon vibe and it's got like the mosaic thing coming through on the other one um and it's very creamy. It's like a lot more creamy than, than either of the other two were. That's freaking awesome. This is the winner. This would, If I was writing this one, you'd get like a 4.7. So take that for what it's worth. You know, just numbers. But uh, anyway, yeah, longer video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, leave a like. Let me know. Um, that way I know to do more of these if I uh, come across some you know, variants that might be similar. Um, yeah, I uh, hope that you guys enjoyed it, like I said, and uh, leave the, hit that like button, would definitely appreciate it. And if you like what I'm doing, hit that subscribe button, would definitely appreciate that as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Hold on.